This is Mission Control Houston, just one minute now from liftoff. Billica tower, tower separated. Fifteen seconds from launch. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Turbo pumps now firing at flight speed and and liftoff. Liftoff of the 49 Progress Reap supply ship rocketing towards the International Space Station on its six hour four orbit rendezvous. 10 seconds into flight, booster ascending into the Kazakh sky, all systems performing normally. First stage boosters continuing to function normally according to reports being fed in from the Russian Mission Control Center in Koryov. Forty seconds into the flight, all systems continuing to function nominally. First stage of the Soyuz booster continuing to fire. Yaw pitch and roll all nominal. Seventy seconds into the flight, continuing to function nominally, under one minute away from first stage separation. Just under two minutes, flight continuing to function, all systems functioning nominally. And the first stage has separated, currently at an altitude of about 30 miles downrange from the Baikonur Cosmodrome, 73 miles. Vehicle traveling at just under 4,000 miles per hour. Second stage thrusters, the core of the Soyuz rocket continuing to function nominally. The launch route has been jettisoned. Progress spacecraft now. Just passing over three hours since launch, all systems continuing to function normally. Second stage will continue to fire till just under the five minute mark. Vehicle traveling at over 5,000 miles an hour.
notice of you inside of the Russian flight control room. And Koryov just about to cross the four minute mark since launch. All stages continuing to function. The second stage currently firing. It'll fire until about the four minute 47 second mark where the second stage will then shut down and jettison. Just past the four minute mark, all continuing to function nominally. Russian controllers reporting the yaw pitch and roll maneuvers all going as planned. So, 4 minute 47 second mark passed, second stage has shut down and separated at an altitude of 103 miles downrange from the Baikonur Cosmodrome of about 178 miles. Vehicle traveling over 8,600 miles an hour now, third stage firing. Over five and a half minutes now into powered flight. First and second stages performing perfectly. The third stage currently continuing to carry the Progress spacecraft towards its orbital insertion. Controllers and Russian mission control and Koryov continuing to confirm that everything going as planned. Just passing the six minute mark of powered flight. The yaw pitch and roll continuing to function nominally, all thrusters performing as planned. Coming up on eight minutes soon of powered flight. Third stage boosters continuing to fire uh, as planned. Progress on its way towards orbital insertion. The time of launch, the station was about 963 miles ahead of the launch site of the Baikonur Cosmodrome. By the time of orbital insertion, this progress will be 2,243 miles behind the International Space Station as it begins its four orbit, six hour chase. Over eight and a half minutes now into powered flight.
coming up soon on third stage shutdown. And third stage shutdown confirmed and separation. Antennas have been deployed. Controllers also confirming the progress solar arrays have been deployed. Navigational antennas as well have also been deployed. So again, third stage shutdown and separation completed. All external structures, navigational antenna, and solar arrays have been deployed successfully. Progress continuing to close in, just about 30 meters away. All crosshairs aligned, everything looking flawless. Again, the team's just a little bit ahead of schedule here. Progress 49 was not supposed to dock for another uh, nine and a half minutes or so, but Russian team's happy with uh, station keeping and decided to press ahead early. At 15 meters. If you look on page 24, you will need to verify that the crosshairs are aligned. Yes, copy. Um, Moscow, uh, we just passed 15 meters now. And we see that uh, our antenna has been retracted. Confirm. Just passed 15 meters. A little bit of a roll bias, but within allowable limits, and uh, the crosshairs are aligned, the range rate nominal. Copy. Nine meters. Range rate is nominal. The crosshairs are aligned. Still a little biased on the roll, but um, still within limits. Copy. And uh, just aligned along the roll axis, and uh, crosshairs are aligned perfectly. Progress. A line standing by for confirmation soon of contact and capture. Range rate nominal. Copy. Four meters. Crosshairs are still aligned. All parameters are within limits. Very good. Just past three meter mark. Copy. Just about two meters left. Just past one meter mark. The crosshairs are aligned. We copy. Contact and capture and confirmed. Contact confirmed at 8.33 a.m. Central Time over Bogota, Colombia. Again, Progress 49, contact and capture confirmed that time, 8.33 a.m. Central 
while the station in progress were flying just about 250 statute miles over Bogota, Colombia. Congratulations uh, on a successful automatic docking.